Hi everyone, welcome back to another video of mine. If you guys are new to my channel, hi, my name is Jessie. I know I look like a space alien right now. I just finished taking a bath. John Ray and I are going out and I thought that it would be a good way to test out these two babies right here side by side compare them which one is the best as you guys have read in the title this is going to be a battle from the smashbox photo finish primer water and the mario badescu facial spray so you are probably going to ask me like jesse why are you comparing the two so to me they have the same job description and they are both used for setting your makeup they are both used for priming your face they are both used for a refresher for your face like for example in the middle of a hot day if you want to feel refreshed all you have to do is you know what i mean and they are both paraben free alcohol free oil free and i'm like and so i went ahead and do this experiment today just to you know give you guys alternatives just in case you guys are on a budget and all that stuff but we will see at the end of the day which one performs the best i have used both of them a lot of times already as you can see in the package so let's talk about them individually first before i skedaddle to the try on parts so this one is 16 dollars, and this is 30 ml the uh, full size is thir around $36 and that is, I forgot how many ml that is, but all of the details I will be putting down on the uh, description box below. I will be providing a link just in case you guys are interested at the end of this video. So the packaging looks like this. I really like the fact that the packaging is pretty simple, but it looks so professional and classy for me. I mean, look at this, right? And this is something that I love to display on my makeup counter just because it's like super simple and super classy. And I have used this a lot of times already, but it doesn't look like it. But, you know, I've used this already. I can say that the mist of this one is like super fine. It spreads it beautifully onto your face. And that's one of the things that I like about this. This one doesn't have any smell. And yeah, that is pretty much it. All of the ingredients, I'll just put them down below on the link. Where you can click that and you can see all of those scientific details out there just in case you are more interested with that but to save your precious time i'm just giving you like bits and pieces on what it's for so going on to the mario badescu this is what the packaging looks like you know what this kind of packaging reminds me of if you guys are into buying and selling and private labeling lotions and all that stuff it actually reminded me of this one no offense but what I like about this one is that it smells so damn good. As you guys have seen, this one has aloe herbs and rose water, and they also have the cucumber and green tea, which is always sold out. So this is the smallest size that they have, and this is a $5. Um, if you get this $7 one, that's going to be like 110 ml, but yeah, two times than this. I'm such a dumb dumb that I didn't do much of a research back then, or probably I was just lazy that I just went to Nordstrom and I saw this and I'm like, ah, I want this. And then I went to Ulta, which is just across, and I saw that the $7 is like yay big, and I'm like, <sighs> and then they have a $12 one that is, I am not kidding as almost as big as this like can like you can literally like <laughs> uh, you know it's a lot sorry if i'm so extra today but what i'm just trying to say is that this is like super cheap even though this is actually placed on the prestige items on the right side of ulta i consider this as a drugstore because they are super affordable so and for five dollars you will be getting 59 ml so that's like more than the $16 one but of course you guys know Smashbox is Smashbox they are literally you know it's not a cheap brand you know what I'm saying this is something that you may not like because Smashbox I did a little research about them if they are already cruelty free but they are still not but this baby right here is cruelty free so let's go ahead and get started okay so on the right side of my face I will be spraying smashbox i will be using this clear thing right here and then just overlap that against my face so that we can see them how they really work so 10 inches 7 to 10 inches let's do that so i'm using it right now as a primer you guys see that it literally covered the half of my face and then moving on to the next one I like the feeling because it's water of course it has this cooling sensation but not like mentholated it's just cool just because of the water okay so now let's move on to the other side and spray the Mario Badescu
The spray is a little bit heavy compared to the Smashbox one. The Smashbox spray is more of like a very soft touch when it gets into your skin. This one is a little bit rough as you can see here on this side is like super, super damp compared to this one. But this one smells good. It's really nice. So I actually tasted a little bit of it because my mouth was kind of open. So that sucks. But anyways, I'm still alive. So what I'm going to do now is that I am going to finish the rest of my makeup. I'm just going to let these two babies dry. Actually, the Smashbox is already dry. I just needed like two pumps. But for this one, I kind of needed a lot just so because I feel like on this area wasn't enough. And then I had to do this area as well. It's not even what I'm trying to say. And if I go farther, I feel like the product is not even gonna get, it's not even gonna reach on my face, but it gives out a lot of product. But as you can see, it is big droplets of water compared to the one that the mist is just really fine. So when it comes to the spraying effect, I would prefer the Smashbox one, but when it comes to the smell, I prefer the Mario Badescu one. So I'm just gonna finish the rest of my makeup and I will be right back. So even, sorry, even before I move on to the makeup part, I just wanna give you guys an update on what it looks like when it's completely dry. So this facial spray has been in my face for a complete four minutes and this is what it looks like. On the Smashbox side, it looks a little bit matte, but compared to the Mario Badescu one, it looks a little bit dewy. You can see that glow on top of my nose and on my cheeks. Compared to the Smashbox one, both of them are moisturizing. I can totally feel it, but the Mario Badescu one is more intense. All right, guys, my makeup is finally done. Now, what are we going to do is that we're going to do the same thing. I'm going to spray one side each, and then I'm going to start with the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. Let me just do that because we're kind of like... And then do the Mario Badescu on the other side. My eyes are like so uneven right now. Whew, <laughs> that smelled so good. That is so refreshing. Okay guys, I will be back at the end of the day and give you guys an update. Does my eyes look so uneven right now? All right, I'll see you guys later. Hi everyone, I am back. Time check, it is 12, 19 a.m. and I actually started this makeup around 3 p.m. So that is a pretty long time. This makeup has been in my face for more than nine hours already. So I can definitely tell you guys how I feel about this makeup. So I did not touch my face. I didn't do any retouch, just my lips because I tried something at Sephora. Oh my gosh, my dumb ass. I had this 10% off coupon and I didn't know that it's just going to start until the 20th. So I was ready to buy these unicorn brushes from Tarte and I was in a counter and I was like, can I use this coupon? And she'd be like, your total is 49. I'm like, can I use this coupon? She'd be like, that doesn't start till the 20th. And I'm like, okay, I'll just wait. But anyways, this is what my face looks like. To tell you guys honestly, I am not gonna lie, I don't feel any difference at all. The only difference is that, let me just correct myself on this one, because I told you guys from the very beginning this one doesn't have any smell. It does have a teeny tiny smell of like an identified flower, but it's not something harsh. So even if you're like super crazy sensitive when it comes to smell, this is not going to hurt you. So compared to the other one, of course, this one smells like herbs and rose water and all of that natural stuff going on. So this one has a stronger smell compared to that one. So look at my face. I will zoom myself in so you guys can see. Again, this one is the Mario Badescu one and this one is the Smashbox one. So no physical activities though, we just walked around the mall, ate, and then watched a movie. So I don't feel any difference, which is amazing because 
I can't believe that this cheap ass facial spray was able to keep up with the expensive one. So to me, you guys know that I love a Smashbox. It's actually one of my favorite brands of all time, especially their contouring kits. However, I really have to give this, I'm not being biased just because it's cheap. You guys have seen it on my face. You can buy this one only five dollars seven dollars twelve dollars you can buy it try it on your own and you will see what i'm talking about and i just choose this one over this one because it does the same exact thing and i actually love the smell of this one i went to ulta and i was trying to see if i can buy those big ass ones but i want to try the cucumber and green tea they do not have the big size so i think i have to order it online i really have to give it up to mario badescu because this is like an all around stuff for me. I even spray this on my hair and my legs if I'm lazy to put lotion on. And it gives me this really nice, you know, softness in my skin. This is just really amazing. Mario Badescu really won this competition just so because one, it is affordable, you'll be getting more. I love the fact that it smells really nice. It's something in my taste. I have smelled the cucumber and green tea and it also smells so deliciously, I don't know, delicious, refreshing or something like that. It's something that when you smell, it's like you want to drink it as well. Am I weird? I know. <laughs> but the only thing, I'm not saying that this one doesn't work. It works, but it's expensive for me, okay? If you are a Smashbox fan, go ahead and buy it. It does the same job. I love the mist. It's super fine. The only detractor on this one is that the mist is kind of like compared to this, this one is like, a, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to waste my product, so I'm not going to, all right, you know what? Fine. Like, see that? And then compared to this one, see, this one is more beautiful. So still have to give it up to Mari Badescu just so because it's affordable, but I will still be using this because this one is amazing as well, though I'll probably buy this when it goes on sale. So that's pretty much it guys, I hope you guys find this video helpful. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already because I upload Mondays to Fridays. I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye. What was that? Bye.